Oh, whoops. Forgot the music. Almost forgot my jazzy intro. Desktop. There we go. Good morning, everyone. Welcome back. Uh, right off the bat, full disclosure, pretty quiet out there. You know, just to just to set the mood. Okay, understand. You know, it's traditionally now wasn't like this last year, obviously. But remember, twenty twenty broke the mold on normalcy, obviously in more ways than one. Remember, traditionally August is the slowest month. You know, I mean, I know it's still July, but we're close. Just understand there will be trades. There is always a trade. There's always a setup. But August is the time to be more selective. Okay. Make sure you're checking all the boxes. All right. So that being said, drop your tickers and questions in the associated chats. Uh, I do have an announcement. Um, because August is traditionally a little slower and I'm an idiot, I am going to begin starting tomorrow, August 1st. Um, right? I don't know. Tomorrow. I don't know if tomorrow's the first or not. Now, but I'm starting tomorrow. Tomorrow's the 31st. Nevertheless, starting, uh, 75 Hard by Andy Frazella. Um, I'm, you know, obviously I'm 63 years old now. It'll probably kill me. Um, probably pretty stupid to do 45 minutes, two 45 minute workouts a day, every single day. Probably pretty idiotic, but hey, you know, I'm a moron. I got a lot of, I got a lot of concussions. I got a lot of head injuries. I am, you know, borderline caveman. So anyways, check it out. 75, 75 hard, 75 days, zero, um, you know, you know, zero leeway. You have to do the five things listed or you have to start over. Check it out. Um, and the bi the biggest reason I bring that up, my friends, is yeah. You know, listen, in trading, there is no there is no sitting still. Okay, uh, you have to be constantly evolving, and you have to constantly be challenging yourself, growing, learning, etc. And I mean, the greatest, not the greatest, a, a, a solid example I give. From 2007 to 2015, you know, the first seven, eight years of my trading career, I was 90% short bias. You know, if you've, you've heard the, check out the, I tell you again, I recommend that podcast all the time. The, the podcast with JJ VWAP Trader. You know, I, I the, 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 the reason it's my favorite podcast is I recognized something in 2015. He confirmed that, and it was like, you know, I I, I laughed like a schoolgirl during that uh, that episode. Anyway, I evolved. I recognized that now that every, I mean, remember the shift was, it used to be impossible to get borrows. It was very difficult to get bar borrows. People thought you couldn't even short these stocks. I mean, it was just different. It was different. Then, all of a sudden, every, I mean, anybody, I mean, I, I, a, a four-year-old kid can short stocks in, right now, you know, and so so the strategy became crowded. What I recognized, I recognized that. I was like, hey, man, th this ain't working no more. It's crowded. Everyone's trying to do that. And that's where the dip and rep came from. A at the end of the day, late 2015 is when the number one morning setup, the low float, sketchy stock with news, et cetera, Dip and rip, you know, the, the week open to attract the short sellers, the chat pump, and then the break of the high of the day with float rotation. It was born in 2015. All right. I went on way too long. Check out 75 hard. I, 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 I enjoyed the previous 18 months with all of you. If I die on day 37, you know, so if like the middle of September, all of a sudden, where's Tim? Eh. Two 45-minute workouts a day probably did me in. 
All right, that being said, AR Pad asking about ERYP. Um, yeah, big spike last night. Um, era phase, what, what is, uh, era space, what, what is this? Um, uh, uh, leukemia. Okay. So, you know, we always say, okay, it's scary. Leukemia is obviously scary. Um, a little bit higher float. Um, decent volume. Just, I just don't like this chart. So I just hate these broken charts. I mean, this thing went from four to 22 last night, closes in after hours at 10, gaps down to five, and it's back up to nine. So I don't, you know, I don't like, like, not giving you a read, but I just, I mean, it's like this. In the last, I mean, look at this, what has happened in the last, you know, 16 hours with this stock. How do you chart this? How do you plan? So I, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to basically say afternoon VWAP holds because my concern is it's just going to do all this wonky stuff like it did last night. I mean, I, I, I can't get a read on something that, that acts like this. So I'm going to say, let's settle on this. I'm really struggling with this one, aren't I? <laughs> so standard, you know, it is Friday afternoon. I mean, 26 million floats, kind of low float. So let's just hope it does this type of move. So let's, it holds the gap. You know, it's still gapping up 100%, even though it's, you know, $15 off of the highs. So let's say, let's hope it holds the gap, grinds sideways, and then perks into the 2 p.m. window. That's the best I got for you on this. But I'm telling you, I, I, I this is I'm going to end with this point. If this is the best one you got, I don't know. If if this is your best idea, maybe it's a day to do something else. Uh, MMAT no volume, broken chart. Eh. Um, ANVS dip by, no, 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 no. You know, I get it. I get it. The traditional, you know, if you watch the, the sad old, old men on TV, they'll be like, oh, you're buying at a discount. I mean, listen, okay. Stocks don't go from a hundred dollars to thirty dollars. I mean, this chart is telling you something, okay? Now, listen. Can ANVS go up today? Sure. You know, and that's I. You know, again, I gotta go fast. I only got fifteen minutes here, so sometimes I don't make this point. I mean, listen. If ANVS runs today, I'm gonna say the same thing. You got lucky. You got lucky, you know. So, I don't, I mean, no, no, no. <coughs> ARDX. <coughs> Dip and rip. 80 million float. I mean, it's a gap to fill over two. Oh, my God. It's such a disaster. ARDX. <laughs> and it's not your guys' fault. Understand, okay, what did I – I gave you guys the chance, okay? I opened this pre-market prep with saying what, – what was the, like, the first words I said? <laughs> so it's not your guys' fault. I'm not yelling at you guys, but – Gap to fill over two. Ah, Sunday ask N about NAOV. Well done, Sunday. This is my number one watch, but I don't have much hope. So, you know, this is that. I, I, I think we talked about this yesterday. You know, this is a lower, lower float stock. It has held up all week. 
if it can break, I mean, if it goes red to green or breaks 275, I mean, basically you're looking at whole dollar, half dollar, quarter dollar areas all the way up. This is dread. So low price stock wise, as much as it pains for me to say this, it's probably my number one. Gross. Gross. Oh, it's almost embarrassing to say that NAOV is my best morning runner. Oh, yeah. So, that being said, my favorite stock of the day, nobody's asking about AMD. If, if, if you were on the webinar last night, you know I broke it all down. We did a sheet uh, on AMD. Broke it all down in extreme detail. Free webinar last night, by the way. So anyway, um, my number one sketch stock, NAOV. My number one real stock, earnings winner, AMD. Uh, GE did a reverse split, for real? What? What are you talking about? Is it coming? GE's doing a reverse split? They are not. I'm getting trolled. It's, it's, I mean, hey, I don't know. I mean, listen, GE, one of the worst run companies in the last 20 years. But I don't know. I'll move on. I, I guess I if they're doing it. I would be shocked if they are, but maybe they are. Uh, Wish. That's not me saying that. A guy on YouTube said they're doing a reverse split. Check that. I, I would be surprised. But anyway, Wish is, remember, this is that. This is the, the Twitter pump. It's dead. Uh, SMS about PLTR. I mean, I still believe in PLTR long term, but all this stock has done is fade, fade, fade. I mean, it is holding support, I guess. So, um, Mike Contreras, COCP. Uh, COCP was the crappy biotech from yesterday. Okay. Remember, my friends. Okay. Listen, yesterday. Pre market yesterday. COCP. Yuck. Today's BVXV. I call yesterday morning at 8.30, I said this thing's disgusting, and it's probably today's BVXV. It's right there. It's time stamped. Man, I love it when people just like show up out of the blue. What would what would possibly make me change my opinion on COCP when I hated it 24 hours ago and all it did was fade? This, this thing's probably worse than BVXV. What's BVXV doing right now? I mean, at least BVXV still, you know, let me look. At least BVXV is still from 250 to 3. COCP's worse than BVXV. What do you think about Amazon swing trade? Uh, love it. You just got to have a long time frame. So what I would do. Red to greens, just like Apple, just like Tesla, just like AMD. Again, so I'm going to leave you with this. If you were on the webinar last night, which I don't know why you weren't, it's free, okay? I freaking, I burned it down last night. Oh, it was incredible. I brought, I brought the heat last night. I mean, actionable. I, the, what I packed into that 45-minute webinar so anyway, most of you are just here because you want picks. Hey, give me something to buy. Give me some sketchy biotech that I can lose fifty percent on. What's an OT? I, I can't. I'm surprised no one's brought up some OTC up nine thousand percent trading three shares in pre market. But anyway, just like AMD was a week open red to green after earnings, just like Apple, just like Tesla, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera, all of these real company. You know. So set your alert. Nail it at 3600 and we'll see it 4000 plus probably by Christmas or something, Amazon. But that being said, understand this is, I mean, this is like the, this is the biggest publicly traded company, right? What's that? So 1.7, what's Apple? Apple's over two. So, oh, geez, Apple's at 25, 2.5 trillion market cap on Apple. Woo! Woo! Anyway, 
second biggest publicly traded company, I think. So you got to understand, have realistic expectations. You know, you're not going to make bank bro on Amazon, but if you're part time, you're trading your IRA. I mean, listen, if you're, if you're, if you're trading a self directed IRA, buy yourself some Amazon. So, all right, my friends, have a good day. Um, I will leave you as I opened. Okay. It's summer. It's August. You know, it just, it's the last trading day of the month. You know, ask yourself this question. If COCP is your best idea, if EY, if, if EYR or ERYP is your best idea, are you trading because it's a good setup? And I know this has been the theme this week, okay? But but I'm, I'm just I'm just telling you the truth, okay? Ask yourself, am I bored? Am I looking for action? Or is this a legitimate good trade setup? Okay? It's not about trading every day. Get over that. Okay. I know, you know, I know Twitter will Twitter will try and convince you the otherwise. Twitter's all about 5,000 trades a day, bro. Get the Lambo, bro. Get the yacht, bro. Bro, 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 bro. 50,000 trades a day, bro. Back in bed by 10 a.m., bro. Okay. No. All right. Have a great weekend, everyone. As always, be sure to check out the weekend watch list. Check out 75 Hard by Andy Frazella. And say a little prayer for this 60-year-old man. And hope that that program doesn't kill me. All right. Check your boxes, man. Be a real trader, not a degenerate gambler bro, all right? That's how you're here 15 years later, like me. So, all right. Have a good weekend, everyone. Uh, TLRY is hanging around. Um, I, so TLRY, a lot of weed news and stuff. I'm going to add this, you know, probably over like 16, 1650. I forgot about it. Nobody asked about it. TLRY over 16, uh, 1650 decent weed stock swing idea. Again, it's not like amazing, but I think if if this can start skipping through whole dollar half dollars, wouldn't surprise me to see this retest the highs from Wednesday night. So, all right, there you go. Another, you know, again, just another decent setup. So, Let's have fun.